We're here at Santa Clarita's newest community, Tesoro Highlands. It's built by Lennar and Toll Brothers. Some of the best builders here in the valley. Toll Brothers is my favorite. We have some legendary, well-known communities here in Santa Clarita. You have Bridgeport, West Ridge, the custom homes in Canyon Country, but it looks like we have a brand new contender here for the top spot in Santa Clarita. So we're gonna be looking at one, two, three model homes here today, and I'm gonna be talking about the entire community, what they have to offer. Guys, I'm, I'm being really, really honest. There are only few homes being built here. So if you're interested, make sure to act quickly because there's not gonna be a lot of homes built here and you already know that there's not enough inventory on the market right now. So these things get, they get snatched up pretty quick. So act fast, sweetie. Okay, it's super hot outside, but we're in the first house, guys. This is what you're first introduced to. We're in a three bedroom, three bathroom house with one half bath and it's 3,095 square feet. So it's a large house. You get a lot of space here and you're gonna see what that space is attributed to. This room that I'm in right now, this is the very first space that you go to. Um, this is not counted in the bedroom count, okay? So this is a bonus space. This is an office space. It's dedicated to that. If you don't have any use for an office space, great, you have a bonus room to utilize. Coming from the office space, we have this long hallway. We have the stairs right there. And then we're going into my favorite space, the kitchen, and it doesn't disappoint. Now, I've mentioned to you guys before, but I'm a cook. I'm the cook in the house. The six burner stove is absolutely amazing. It looks great. You have the sink right across the way from there, which is really, really important if you like to cook. And you have the built-in appliances right here. Again, this is all included with the pricing, okay? You have different packages available, yes, and there are options available, but for the majority, like this is included, which is amazing. I feel like I breeze past this way too quick. This is a beautiful stove. It looks gorgeous. And this is like my dream stove here. It's built in, it has a matching hood here. You got a ton of light coming in and you have enough space for a faucet to be installed. So like, that's, that, that's amazing. One of the most important things that my clients look at in regards to a house is the space that they're actually going to be living in, which is usually the kitchen and living room space. And the flow is very, very important to them. And I believe that the flow here is actually pretty cool. It goes from a small dining space into the living room space because a lot of families now are going into the scene where they're eating at the island there and it's, that's the common space. That is the space that is most important for people. And I think that's something that they did very, very well. Wrapping up what we have downstairs, we have the very first bedroom, okay? This is a master bedroom at that. The idea behind this is that this whole community is part of like the next gen series that they have going on. This is getting really popular here in Santa Cruz. So the idea here is that you have two generations in one home. So it's built for maybe the in-laws, your parents are gonna stay with you, or maybe even a guest, you have a premium space for your guest. All right, we're finally upstairs and this space, it shows you where the square footage really goes. This loft space is amazing. This is a second living room. This is the place where the family is actually going to get together and maybe separate yourself from the kids. They're, they're downstairs, you're upstairs, whatever it may be. This is an amazing space. It's rich in light, which is really important and you don't see that very often. Upstairs, we have two bedrooms. The second bedroom is going to have its own walk-in closet. There's a bathroom right next door so that it's easy access for everybody that would be in the loft space as well. Then we have the master and the walk-in closet is massive.
this is definitely a entertainer's space. That's what they have at Stage Desk. Now this lot size isn't guaranteed with the builder. You have to be very strategic with what lot you're actually going for to see what your goals are. Depending on which lot that you actually choose is gonna dictate how much space you have to do something like this. This much space is probably not enough space for a pool if that's what you're going for. The backyard space is typically not built out by the builder. It's gonna be customized by you. So you make sure you have enough budget for that. With the housing market being so limited, a lot of my clients are reaching out to me asking what their equity really looks like. Are they getting less? Are they getting more? And they don't really trust the websites that are out there. They don't trust the Trulia's, they don't trust the Zillow's. So they're asking me what is a good resource for them to utilize? Because a lot of those companies are way off on their estimates. So what's the solution? There's a website that I send my client to and it's called HomeBot. And HomeBot uses AI to calculate your home value. So all you have to do is either click the link in my bio or scan this QR code right here and it'll take you to the website. So you can sign up and get monthly emails from HomeBot directly. So you're not getting an email from a real estate agent or anything like that. It's directly from HomeBot. It's super simple, non-invasive, but just so you know, I am sponsoring the program. So I am paying for the service for you to get it for free. Now, Residence 2 of the Campana series introduces you to the home a little bit differently. To the right, you have a full bathroom and a bedroom space. It's not an office space this time. You have a bright hallway entrance flowing right into the living and kitchen space. four bedrooms, four bathrooms, 3,285 square feet in this house. And you can tell that the first floor has a ton of space. This time you have a dedicated dining space and you have this massive kitchen flowing right into the living space and it's, it's staged so well, it looks immaculate. One thing I wanna to mention to you guys is that you want to have a real estate agent to back you up when you're taking a look at these properties. Have an agent actually book the tour for you. If it's not me, then have it with somebody else that you trust, whoever, whatever agent that it is. But you wanna have an agent to back you up because the representatives here represent the company. Now they probably more than likely have your best interest in mind, but when you have a dedicated real estate agent to actually be there and get you through the process step by step, it's that much better and they're gonna make sure that they're looking at you for your best interests and not the company's best interests. Now there is some extra space back here. As you can see, they have it dressed as a workout room, but of course you can do whatever you want with it. It's a great space and it flows right into the backyard. Now this, this is a loft space. They're killing it. They're killing it with the loft spaces that they got here. Again, this is a four bedroom home. You got three bedrooms upstairs. And the master, although not as big as I would expect, a great utilization of the space itself. And the bathroom is absolutely fantastic. Look at all the bright light coming into the room. That, that is an entrance. And this is an amazing living space. It flows right into the kitchen. This house got me so distracted, I almost forgot to film the facts about the house. So it's a five bedroom, four bath with 3,920 square feet. And you can definitely tell you have a ton of space in this house. Now I'm in the loft space now. It's not as big as the other two lofts that we've seen in the other two homes in the Campana series, but there's a ton of light just being just pushed into the house. It makes it feel really nice and open. Now I'm showing you everything with these houses that I can, but one thing that I cannot show you that I can't really interpret is this. Mm -hmm. 
I know it's really hard to decide whether or not this is the right home for you. It's, it's almost impossible to make a decision off of one video and to even make a decision on a neighborhood on one video. The thing is, I created a neighborhood playlist right here about the different neighborhoods here in Santa Cruz to help you be better educated about the area. And I'm gonna have more videos coming out just like that. So make sure to subscribe and I'll see you guys next time.